Hello Tankers, Jay here to welcome me back to episode 25 of the Esports News Show. This episode includes all the latest news about TOF Dream Team, changes to its rules, congratulations, and more on its FAQs, Master of the Sword Shiro promo and launch, results for Blitz number 2420 and 2520, Blitz number 2620 launch, and information on the latest articles. Let's jump straight in! news! The ongoing TOF Dream Team tournament is in full swing and 8 unbeatable clans have already qualified for the last playoff stage after several decisive battles in the second group stage that ended on September 24th. Now all that's left is to watch those 8 fight for the victory and for the fiery acid paint. Meanwhile, number 2420 Blitz's Light ended on September 18 with Revenge in the first bracket, Vertical in the second, and Hello Kitty in the third bracket as winners. Also, Mass of the Sword Trio is back with registrations opening on September 18th, scheduled to start on September 29th. It is now underway with many cool trios competing for the Impulse Paint, a 1.2 million crystal prize pool, 80 containers, 500 batteries, 2 shot effects for Railgun, and the augments for Wasp and Hornet, as well as a Spectrum B Protection module. A slightly smaller list of prizes except with the gladiator paint await the runners up and other decent prizes for other finishers. In other news, number 2520 Blitz Hard ended on September 25th with Winner's Revenge, Pulse, and only TOF from each of the three brackets respectively. My congratulations to the winners of both number 2420 and 2520. Three and a half hours after the start of the last matches on number 2520 and 2620 Blitz Hard appeared with registrations open until 12 UTC on September 28th with matches starting at 16 UTC. Article news! It's time to unbuckle this episode's loads of articles. First up, posts TOF Dream Team, round 7 predictions, and a person randoms after the game. TOF Dream Team first group stage recap with some thoughts on what's to come. Then we have Blitz number 2420 Grand Finales. Predictions reviewed by Mr. Nose and Person Random on TOF Dream Team's second group stage insights feat intense. And finally, we have predictions for the second group stage of TOF Dream Team. A post predicts round 1 in Person Random predicts round 2 and the final round. If you want to join our wonderful esports reporters crew, get in now via the application form on the volunteers recruitment portal linked below in the description. Good luck to you! General news, now for something we didn't mention when we talked about the TOF Dream Team's frequent asked questions posts in a previous episode. You can ask any question about TOF Dream Team via Tanky Sports support feature. Any answers to the most frequent questions will be published in the frequent answers question post in the tournament's topic on the forum. September 18th saw congratulations from the esports administration to all the 16 clients that made it into the second group stage of the TOF Dream Team tournament along with some changes to paragraphs 3.5.2 and 2.2.2 of the tournament as leaders of the participating clans voted for them 6 against 5 with 5 absentations in a close margin. Due to the recent update to some maps, it was announced that general tournament rules would be updated and announced in the esports bulletin board on the forum. The same day was an announcement about the Mass of the Sword Trio launch with a stunning promo video, as well as dates and information important for registration. And on September 21st, point 3.2 of TOF Dream Team rules was amended to now state, battles taken place in 5 vs 5 no more than one of the same hall for each team and Hopper is not allowed. Well tankers, that's all. This has been the Esports News Show bringing you the hottest esports news and results from the previous week as well as keeping you updated on what's going on so you always know what's happening in the esports community. Want more? Stay tuned! The next episode should be out within two weeks. Uh, so make sure to leave a like if you liked it, subscribe if you loved it, and share your thoughts in the comment section down below. 